Niger Delta is a major unpleasant phenomenon which the quest of its end is not in sight yet. Millions of barrels of oil have been siphoned from the shores of the country unaccounted for. Reasons for these nefarious acts are not far-fetched. The Chief of Defense Staff General Christopher Musa some times ago said the communities in the region protect those carrying out the oil bunkering and also help to rebuild illegal oil refineries whenever the military personnel destroy them. This confirms the fact that the country is losing huge amounts of money to illegal activities in the region as crude oil theft intensifies. Just some days ago, President Bola Ahmed Tinubu gave directive to the service chiefs to ensure that they secure the entire South South to enable NNPC and others to carry out their task to improve oil production. It was revealed that the joint task force with the land components of all the other agencies are going to work together to bring results. Operations will as well focus on tracking the point of loading to the destination point of the crude oil. Furthermore, operations will concentrate on the surveillance of pipelines, jackets and wellheads to prevent breaches. This explains why the Nigerian military announced the revamping of ongoing operations to combat crude oil theft in the region. And it is to be conducted under a unified command structure for all security agencies operating in the Niger Delta. Will this bring forth the expected permanent solution of oil theft in the Niger Delta region?